What is up guys, Chrismich42 here, and I am finally back with a episode of Crazy Mod Survival Season 3. So yes, I know it's been, I'd say about a month, and I'm so, so very sorry about it. As you guys may or may not have known, I did have a corruption with my hour-long episode, and I haven't had time to actually record anything of Crazy Mod Survival because... I've been having problems with the actual world, and just, just everything went wrong. <laughs> everything just went wrong. So I've been posting a lot more of other series, and that's why I haven't gone back on this. But I finally fixed everything. And yes, I have a fox in my head. Don't start singing, please. Uh, that was terrible last night. Anyway, <laughs> um, we, I also did a little live stream last night. Not really. And by me, I mean Mr. Programmer. And by live stream, I mean his live stream, because I was on it. And it was a lot of fun. Wasn't that many people, but hey, it's not about the people, it's about having fun, right? And I can also live stream now, which is awesome! I've upgraded my computer to the max! So now it's a 10.9, so I can live stream. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, I hope you guys are having a fantastic Thanksgiving. I am having a pretty good one myself. I just ate some strawberry shortcakes. Uh, I had some Zeppelis. I had some pumpkin pie. And I sound mad fat right now. I've probably gained about 30 pounds today, you know, had the turkey, you know, the whole enchilada. Um, but as you guys know, the one on the 10th episode was corrupted, and it was an hour long, so I did do a lot of stuff in that episode, which kind of sucks. But, um, with Doggy Talent, I finally figured it out, and look we have! If you guys may not know who this person is, this is actually from the Varn G, one of my, like, actual first, I guess, modded survivals that I really got into. And I do actually plan on going back to Divine RPG in the future, but I can't go back into my old world due to the uh, IDs and stuff they fixed. So when it upgrades to... Because right now it's good, but it's really buggy and stuff right now. So maybe in the future I will go at it again and make it maybe a second season. I don't know, it's up to you guys. Maybe you guys will like it, but I, I think I'll have a lot of fun with it. But yeah, we got Neptune here. Neptune. Too bad he doesn't have the spikes sticking out of his back. But we got Neptune. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet, the bands. So, today I do want to try and find a turkey and cook it, just because, you know, Thanksgiving. Um, and I was thinking about making, uh, what is it called? Well, I know we have strawberries, but can I make anything out of the strawberries? Can I make, like, a pie? <gasps> I can't make a pie. Um, strawberry ice cream. Can I make strawberry cake? No. Um, let me see. Ice cream. What types of ice cream? Ice cream. Chocolate. Caramel. Mint chocolate chip. I want to... I'm gonna feel fat today. I'm in a fat mood. Um, <laughs> I'm in a fat mood. Leave me alone. I shall eat anything I want. Um, so let's see. What can we make? And there's still a crap ton of stuff I need to actually start working on with all these mods. And I know it's been a while. That we'll be trying to post this at least two to three times a week now. Because I know I've been really holding it back. And I don't want to, but... Ugh, it's a pain. But anyway, so besides that, which you can see over here, we have the nether portal here, and we have the eternal frost here. I don't know if I might have done this in the ninth episode, I'm not really sure. But um, we did get an eternal frost last episode, which would have been ten, but, you know. I'm not explaining the situation again. We did go mining as well. So it was actually a good thing we didn't get onto eternal frost, because that would have sucked. And you guys would have missed a crap ton of stuff. So thank god you guys... Well, me, anyway, took a while building something spectacular. But today, look, we got eight diamonds, a crap ton of gold, a crap ton of iron, like five gold ingots. We got the flint and diamond here. We also have a diamond pick, which I'm going to grab. And now I get to show you the awesome sauce, which took me 40 minutes of the episode, even though it's still not out, and I'm very upset about it. That sucker over there, which is dope as hell, I must say. It did take a very long time to make, though. It was a maple place, so you can imagine how long that took. Um, but we still got the farm I fixed, uh, sugarcane, which, please, people remind me in the comments that I do have to make a freaking enchantment table room. I keep forgetting about it, but... Uh, I don't know how to tame elephants, so I'm gonna have to figure that one out. Um, there is a lot of nature around. Strange. Um, I've also invited somebody very special onto the series, as you guys might know by just looking in the mirror a second ago. The mirror, the window. <laughs> it's Vanilla. Hi, girl! Um, so I got Vanilla. As you guys may not know who this person is, 
She is uh, the first horse that I got in my first ever season of Crazy Mod Survival, and she's been a big part of different series. Well, not a big part. I haven't actually seen her in a very long time. But uh, we've had we've had seen some of our relatives from survival games and stuff when I was on the whole. Holy crap! This tiger is fierce. Um, but yeah. So we do have Vanilla, which is a regular horse, but now we also have Yam, which is our wild horse from Mo Creatures. And we also have two special persons that I said we were getting three horses. We got Coco and we got Newbie. So yeah, pretty terrible names, I know. Um, but I will have to work on making a place so they can mate, because uh, I didn't really work on that. And this tiger is giving me like the scariest thing. Hey, tiger! Oh, he's not in here. If you guys don't know who that is, it's my cat. Um, but yeah, not too much was done. But that was the biggest part. I really hope you liked this. Uh, comment down below if you like this. This did take me a very freaking long time. It took me 40 minutes of that hour-long thing. There, see, this, this, this took a while. <laughs> As you can tell, this took a very long time. I tried to put gravel and stuff to make it look somewhat uh, realistic barnish type. Um, does that have, like, ram ears with the ring on it? I don't even know. But you're dying because I want that hat. Um, see, so yeah, we still have all the mods in here, and it's very, very running, actually, very smoothly, because, as I said, I did just upgrade my computer, this took me an hour and a half. <gasps> yes! Yay! 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 Yeah! They, aw. Give me that, give me that turkey breast. Mm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Turkey. Alright, we're gonna cook this, and I'm not gonna eat any, because I've already had my share, but I will give some to Veronica, and I will give one to Cherry, my lovely wife and my lovely daughter. And I am thinking about getting a son or uh, another daughter. I don't know yet. It might happen this episode. It might not happen. But uh, we need to go to the Eternal Frost. And it's also Sun is as well. And I want to show off my awesome stereo. Let me see. Where is that song? Yeah, I like the song. So if, uh, if you guys weren't there for the live stream yesterday, nothing much happened. I mean, we were just messing around the whole time. We did meet a couple of fan people. It was really nice to meet some of you. Uh, there wasn't that many viewers on there, but it was a lot of fun. We did have a crap ton of fun, me, Mr. Programmer, and T-Dog. We had a lot of fun with it. Um, but here you go. Here is your thing. Oh, I should probably cook this. Yeah, that's probably not healthy. <laughs> Don't want to give her a raw turkey for Thanksgiving. That's probably not a good husband-like thing to do. Um, so we got that. And let me put this in here. Because we want to head to the Eternal Frost. Even though it's Thanksgiving and I was thinking about doing some Thanksgiving stuff, I mean, there's not much to do with Minecraft with uh, Thanksgiving. So, yeah, let's try and get to the Eternal Frost. That was actually our really main goal, was to get to that freaking nightmare place. I've never been to the Eternal Frost, so this should be interesting. Um, I don't know if we're supposed to go there with items, because it is kind of like a new world, I know. Um, but I, I guess we'll figure it out. I mean, that, it shouldn't be too hard. Uh, gold black. Alright. Yeah, Kirk the Taki. I always knew I was a chef in some way or form. Alright. Veronica, here is your present for Thanksgiving. A nice cooked turkey. Just for you. You don't have to say anything. I know. I'm a nice, I'm a nice husband. Um, anything cool on mine, bae? Mm, I still need to buy that oven for her. She really wants that oven. <laughs> Hi, Neptune. I would give you the turkey, but, uh... You've got, you got your steak and your pork chops there. Ooh, snap. Jesus Christ. You just sit down. What are you doing? Get off my, get off my table. Ah, get down. Yeah, so you got some steak and you got some cooked pork chops. Sure, you're good. You're good. That's your Thanksgiving. Um, I need to find cherry. I need to go, oh my god, Neptune. Stay upstairs. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, this dog. Ever since the Vine G, you've been a derpy son of a gun. What the hell is going on? Alright. Sit. Sit. Good boy. Alright. Stay. Don't go through the floor. Stay. Alright, good job. Alright. Stay. 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 Don't use your divine powers here. That's no... <laughs> My family doesn't need to know about that. They already think you're a freaky dog. Alright, hello, Cherry. And here is your Thanksgiving present. A nice cooked turkey. I hope you enjoy that. Yes, yes. Um, and you guys might have also seen on my inventory that I have <gasps> Snowy on me. And you're probably wondering, Mitch, why do you have Snowy on you? Well, as you guys may or may not know, the Eternal Frost is a very frozen place. A very chilly place. It's very frosty. Oh, man, I just killed it. Um, but I want to go there and I want to try and make a home for Snowy because she did grow up in the snow, as you guys may or may not know. 
So that'd probably be a good thing to actually make her live in a snowish type of biome. I don't know what the hell that was. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna bring Snowy along as well, and we need to light this sucker. Mm, Flint diamond. Kaba! Now I am gonna bring my armor, but I don't think we're supposed to bring anything else. So I'm just gonna, you know, the casual torches, some delicious grubs, and the bunny and my backpack. All right, I'll be back later, honey. I'm going to the Eternal Frost. Peace out. And we also get this thing right here, which is a, I'm going to say this completely wrong, epithermic, epithermic meter, which is, like, dying from the cold. Whoa. Holy crap, this place is really laggy. Wow. Wow. Hello. Hello, Lunaland. What is this? Is this frozen sand? Oh, it's clay. It's clay? That's weird. Blue clay balls. Yes. Yes, you heard me. Blue clay balls. Delicious. Um. But yeah. The Eternal Frost. <laughs> Here we are. In the Eternal Frost. So I guess our first objective is to probably go in. Get that tree over there. And we're going to use Snowy to smash all these clay blocks in. The nice cool blue fire. It's really, really cool. I might grab that and bring, that, bring some of that blue fire home. Uh, how do I get... Okay, I gotta go this way. Uh, another thing is I probably don't want to go in the water. I will. I don't want to go in the water. Because then I will die. The water is very, very cold here, as you could probably guess. Um, ooh, there's some new ore over there. I don't know what that is. Um, but yeah, this is my first time actually using Eternal Frost Mods. This is pretty, uh, pretty some sweet sauce over here. Uh, that, that's cold. I'm guessing. <laughs> that's my, as I guess, you know. I just have that ability to know what things look like. Like, this is probably like frozen cobblestone or something. That's my guess, anyway. Alright, so let's get to this tree. The tree. Let's get over here. Uh, wow, these branches take forever to break. What the hell? I didn't... <gasps> Holy crap, I almost killed Snowy. Oh my god. Huh. Ha! Holy crap, that scared the hell out of me. <laughs> I almost killed Snowy. I got her trapped inside this stupid tree. Um, I don't even know what's in my inventory, because I just got so scared. I thought I almost murdered my own bunny. It would have been terrible. I would have gotten, like, comments, like, bunny abuser and stuff, and I'm not that type of person. I don't just kill my bunnies. Alright, um... Ha! <laughs> Heart attack nation. Um, yeah, see, everything's kind of retarded <laughs> with these mods. These mods just, like, broke everything. This is a cool crafting table. Hoppa! Let me, uh, put some torches, because you guys probably may not be able to see. Alright. Okay, then. Um, I'm just gonna guess that this could be a problem. Just saying. Um, <laughs> alright. Like, um, Sure. Um, what is this? Right here we have Snowbark, uh, Frozen Pear. Actually, it doesn't sound that bad. Um, <laughs> but anyway, let's, let's mine some stuff. I don't even know what this is. What is this? This has got to be coal, or revelvent of coal. Okay, I can't even get it. Alright then. So I guess I'm going to need this, most likely. This is, my guess is Frozen Cobblestone. Yep. Alright. Good work, Mitchell. You have discovered that in a frozen laced land of we all know is now it's going to be called frozen cobblestone. Good job. Um, but I guess we're going to use this snowbark thing. And we have to stay pretty close to that portal because then I'll get lost. And then that, that goes the end of me. Um, but I know you can make like an oven or something. Oh, crap. Uh, yeah, here we go. An ice oven. I don't really know how to work this. So this could end pretty well. Uh, let me get some more sticks. Get more sticks. Let me get more sticks. Let me get more sticks. And again, I get that frozen ice cobble pickaxe. That ice cobble pickaxe. That ice, that ice cobble pickaxe. Yeah. Because we know we all got that ice cobble pickaxe. That ice cobble pickaxe. That ice cobble pickaxe. Is this coal or is this frozen coal? Because I don't know anymore. Because this game is mad confusing. Uh, this is coal. 
Oh, and I like the torches they have here. Can I, uh, can I show you guys real quick? Darn it. Do I need a Pacific type? Uh, crystal, other stuff. Oh, I need frozen glowstone dust. How the hell do I get that? Is that frozen glowstone? That could be what I'm looking for. Um, yeah, let's go, like, right here. Let's see, if we can, let's see how high. Oh, we have to watch out with the epithermic meter as well. Is this the, uh, the frozen glowstone that we need? Yes, it is. Alright, sweet. Let me get some of this. Where you can go with this, or you can go with that. Ow. You can <laughs> go with this, or you can go with that. Uh, does torches help? No, it doesn't seem like it. Um, so let's make... Oops, shoot. I want to put my, uh, my freaking pickaxe in there. That'd be pretty sad. Frozen cobblestone... Oh, God. Frozen glowstone torches. Perfect. Alright. Now, I do want to go see that new ore, so I guess I'm going to grab this pickaxe and be on my way. I can't speak English. I'm going to grab this crafting table and be on my way. Um, so I need to stand next to this fire or something to get my pythermic meter back up. Uh, I think. Does this work? It's not working. It's not working. It's not working. Okay, there we go. Now it's working. Whew! Alright. Huh! <sighs> I'm starting to chatting as much, but I, I'm trying to figure this all out with all this new stuff, and it's just, I'm like, taking it all in. Um, I don't need any coal at the moment. Is that the freaking, what the hell is that? I don't even want to know. I know there's a way you can get up on the land, because there's like, biomes, different types in this place, I think. Ooh, what is that? What is this? Do I mind this? Do I? Oh, is this like a dungeon? Hold up, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. How do I... How do I do this? I don't know what this is. What is this? Do I click it or something? Do I act? How do I? What is this? Wait, let me let me mine it out. Um. Mm, I don't know. I don't want to break it because I don't know what it does. Um, if you guys could let me know what this thing is, please. Because I'm afraid to break it, because if I break it, and that's not how you're supposed to activate a dungeon, or that's what I think this is anyway. Um, I don't want to break it, and then you guys get mad aggravated, because I know these are kind of rare. Um, so, please let me know how to activate that. I think you're supposed to break it, but I'm very nervous to break it, because I know how people can get if I do something completely wrong. You would just flip the hell out and, like, kill me. Um, <laughs> anyway, so I think this is a crystal... Or something? I'm not sure. I don't even know what I'm saying. Uh, can I get this? Well, crap. Um. Well, shiznits. <laughs> I didn't expect that to break all the way. Alright, so let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. What is that? I don't even know. Excuse moi. I need to get up here. I also need to build our little furball snowy home here. I don't even know if she could live here. So that could be a good or bad thing. Because when I placed her down, she was dying. But I'm not sure if that was from the biome. Or just dying because she was suffocating. Ooh, frozen pear again. Nice. Yeah, see, I'm kind of scared. I'm skeptical right now. Because I don't really know what I'm doing in this place. Um, <laughs> I'm mad scared. Hold my hand, please. Hold it. Hold it with your forceful grip as we fetch our fort in the eternal frost. Um, but anyway, it's gonna be a random conversation right now because I'm gonna be clicking with my bare hands. But, uh, hey, does anybody like anime out there? Anybody? Anybody, huh? Comment down below if you like anime. Um, I just got into it about a couple days ago. I just watched my first anime ever besides Dragon Ball Z and stuff, I guess. Because I, I did like Dragon Ball Z, because, you know, that, that, was my, that was my show when I was little. In my game, and it's still my game because I rock in Dragon Ball Z. But anyway, um, so if if you like anime, and it's in English, because please, I don't want to watch subtitles. So, uh, let me know of an anime, because I'm trying to get into it. I do like it. I just watched the anime called Is That a Zombie, and I really enjoyed it. Except I didn't know that they were only made two seasons, and I don't even know if they're making a third, which is kind of pissing me off because I really enjoyed it. I don't even want to know what that was. Um, I don't think I can get this. Or can I? God damn it. Ah! Uh, Duh! How do I get this? I must need something. I gotta need something for this. I don't know. 
I don't know anymore. I don't want to go in the water. I think that's sand. Um, I think I might leave it off here, though. So I, so maybe you guys can comment down below and let me know what the frig I'm supposed to do. Because I have no clue. I am... Pff, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Um, so I think I'm going to leave it like that. So that way I don't get myself killed or something in here. Or I don't do something wrong. But I'm going to leave it here. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed episode 10 of Crazy Mod Survival. I know this was kind of an awkward one. Because of this new biome and portal place. Logical. Um, but yeah, please comment down below. How the heck do I activate that dungeon thingy? Um, if I'm actually allowed to... If you guys want me to bring like my actual stuff over. I don't know if it changes the game or anything. I'm not... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but that's really it for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed. If you enjoyed, remember to hit that like button down below. Because that lets me know that you actually liked me bringing this back. I know, I'm sorry. I haven't done it in a while, but... Gotta give me some respect here. I've been doing a lot lately. Like, literally, I've been doing a crap ton of stuff. But, hopefully you enjoyed. Anyway, my name is Crazy Mitch 42 I don't know why I did that. And, I will see you all later. What does your fuck say?